Welcome to Fifth and Overland. I'm Jesse, and I want to talk about what I've experienced since starting the Carnivore Way of Eating. I'm on week six, and this has been such a great thing for me and for my husband. I have suffered from fibromyalgia for many, many years, and this has really changed my everyday life. I've noticed a huge difference in my energy levels and in my overall sense of happiness. I have dealt with pain, depression, low energy, inflammation, and anxiety. And I was told that this was all in my head and that there was nothing I could do about it. It's incurable. And I just have to learn how to manage the symptoms and deal with the pain. I feel better than I have in years. I have a lot more energy and I kind of feel like I'm getting my life back. I wake up early. I'm more efficient throughout my day. I don't get overwhelmed like I did before. And like I'm able to focus and stay on task. I'm able to manage my time better. Following the carnivore way of eating is, is eating meat, dairy, eggs, bacon, lots of butter, salt, and water. And it's cutting out plants and fruits, vegetables, and anything made with plants, pasta, cakes, cookies. What I've found in my research is that plants have anti-nutrients, and these anti-nutrients can cause us harm. And cutting out the plants cuts out these anti-nutrients, and we can start to recover and heal from that. One of the anti-nutrients is called oxalate, and I believe that I'm suffering from oxalate toxicity, and that getting off plants and following the carnivore way of eating is helping me to reduce those oxalates and reduce inflammation and pain and depression and anxiety and all the other stuff that goes along with oxalate poisoning. I think that there's two things that happen when you start following a carnivore diet. First of all, you stop eating the oxalates. And so you're not having that toxicity. Plus when you're eating meat, you're getting bioavailable food that helps to rebuild what the oxalates were breaking down. Either way, I'm benefiting from eating more meat. Having fibromyalgia and eating plant-based was really difficult. Every day, just so much inflammation and so much brain fog. I'm a doTERRA consultant and doTERRA came out with a new collagen powder a few months ago. And I started taking that and I started feeling so much better. And I thought, if this is helping me this much, there must be more. And so I started researching more about the carnivore way of eating and about plant oxalates and what it's doing to us. And I just jumped right in. I made a decision one day, this is what I'm doing. And I went in full force and I haven't looked back. I am still taking the collagen. My husband and I both love it. Another surprise that I found following the carnivore way of eating is that I want to exercise. <laughs> I want to go out and go walking and I want to be out in the sunshine and I want to be doing things. I have so much energy. I'm cleaning my house. I get up and move around more. I want to work out. I want to go on walks. And it's just a total difference from what I have been suffering from for so long with fibromyalgia of not wanting to move or being scared to move or being scared to do anything and then having the repercussions of the next several days of where you just can't do anything. This is completely different. The depression and the anxiety are fading away. With fibromyalgia, we get intrusive negative thoughts and those are gone. I can't believe that eating butter and bacon and beef and eggs is taking away the depression and anxiety that I've suffered with for so long. I can't believe that it's taken away those intrusive negative thoughts that are so prevalent with fibromyalgia. I feel relaxed. I feel like I'm taking better care of myself. I feel like I'm taking better care of my home. And I feel like I'm taking better care of those around me. Removing all of the fruits, vegetables, and processed foods from my diet has given me my power back. Beef, butter, bacon, eggs, cheese, butter, bacon. <laughs> Cold bacon is fantastic. <laughs> I never guessed that high protein and high fat would be so beneficial for me. Please keep checking back. I'll have more interviews, more updates on the carnivore way of eating. And check out my other channel, Catalina Treats, Carb-Free Kitchen, where I make different recipes for the carnivore way of eating. And please 
research and find out more about this way of eating, there are so many great channels. Dr. Anthony Chafee, Dr. Ken Berry, The Steak and Butter Gal. My husband and I are so glad that we committed to our health and decided to follow this way of eating. 